Ratatouille takes place in modern day Paris, France. You know, food is king, and it's a beautiful city, and the beauty of the city kind of contradicts what it's like to be a rat. You've got this grungy, nauseating, disgusting place that the rats live, and then you have this pristine kitchen environment. These worlds come together via Remy's desire to cook in this five-star French kitchen. It's a bold move, I think, to have rats as your main characters. A lot of people, I think, uh, find them repulsive. I don't want to talk about the tail. What about my adorable peach fur-covered little ears? You know, no one ever asked rats about that. For us, it's a matter of doing a lot of reference, really. It's, it's looking at a lot of real rat footage. People have brought in their pet rats, which at first we were a little afraid of, because again, rats are a little like, <laughs> rats. But now we've actually got our own rats in the animation department, and uh, they're endlessly entertaining. And we've been videoing those rats and looking at that footage. Not necessarily copying it, but taking the spirit of, of what makes a rat a rat, how quickly they move, and, and all of the little fidgety traits. Our main character, Remy, he has this amazing sense of smell. And he picks out the food that all the rats in the tribe can eat. But Remy is very interested in fine food. He wants to be a five-star French chef. The rats are traditionally kind of takers. They're hiding, they're sneaking, they're stealing little things. And the chefs are givers. They're creating things and presenting them to people. And Remy is a real giver.